Art is one medium that allows people to express themselves, to express their individuality, and to contribute to a national dialogue. And that's exactly what we did here today. There are artists from all over Africa talking about a common African narrative. It is the first professionally curated exhibition in the township. The truth is that art isn't just about buyers. It's about what art does to help us create who we are. I'm very, I'm very, very proud and happy about my art show here in Alex. I feel very happy meeting young artists, admiring my work and liking my work, inspiring them, inspiring the community and the others who don't know about the artists who are living nearby. These are the shining stars of tomorrow. If you don't start buying their artwork today, maybe in five years' time you won't afford it. I'm not lying. I know it for a fact because I've seen how the, 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 the professionalism that they put into their work. Amongst the very young artists, I was very impressed to see one of the founders of the Bag Factory, David Kolwani. When Vic and I first met, what we talked about was xenophobia. And what is xenophobia about borders? and tucked away here are six Zimbabwean and one Malawian artist. And you will notice that you can't tell who's the Zimbabwean, who's the South African. Then I am an African, that's Zimbabwe. Art helps in the discussion on xenophobia because some of us lived in exile and in all these countries where we lived, we are never taken as foreigners. Our young people have not had that exposure. So this art exhibition contributes to the fact that whether you are a foreigner or you are not a foreigner, at the end of the day we are all one people. We are all human beings. Alexander itself is a melting pot of different people when it was formed more than 100 years ago. So it's quite ironic that issues of xenophobia, they, they can be brought to Alexander. Not to mention that even the great man himself, Nelson Mandela, spent some time here in Alexander. Art has always been a vehicle to cross borders. The fact that it's been emphasized today, once again, shows that art can assist us in building those bridges. We've introduced the conversation now. It's a matter of taking it further. The Echikovitz Family Foundation is all about partnerships. We all have to make our contribution and through partnering with Barca, through partnering with, with the Art Smart brand, through partnering with, with other organizations, we can go out multiply our capability and go and do special things. Without th those kinds of partnership, we won't be able to do what we've done today. Alex isn't just about our past. It also isn't just about our present, but it's about what we can be as South Africans, as Africans into the future. Viva South Africa! Viva! And viva all that live in her! Viva.